Hey guys, and welcome back to Bravery the Fault. So in today's episode, we have to take, take on the Miasma Woods. There's something about this place that just puts me on edge. I'm, I'm not entirely sure what it is. This gives me the heebie-jeebies. Maybe it's these scorpions. Or weird uh, tree things that scare me a lot. Alright. Never run the fault for the time being, and uh, yeah, I'm going to actually have you uh, do some examination on these things. So let's try the scorpion. Scorpion. Whoa, that's a lot of HP. Thousand. Weak to water. Okay. And it's a bug. Clearly. 120 damage. Uh, that's not too bad. Could be a lot worse. In that case, Tiz, I'm going to have you brave and we're going to show off some uh, sword magic, which I have not done yet. So what we actually have the ability to do is, is we have the ability to equip our sword with magic, which is so good. So I'm going to put blizzard magic on our sword, and then we're going to attack the scorpions. And we'll do two more on the other one. Anyas, I'm going to have you drop a blizzard on one of the scorpions. Ring a bell, I'm going to have you drop a blizzard. And Adia, I think I'm going to have you, if this thing's still alive, by the, by the way, the, uh, the treant. So this is pretty good, we can actually expose our opponent's weak points without actually having to spend NP. Although it's a lot bulkier than I thought it was going to be. Let's see, now 1000 HP, weak to fire, and you're a plant, obviously. Whoa, 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 what do you think you're doing? Doing 400 damage to ring a bell like that, that's ridiculous! Oh, see you ring a bell, it's nice knowing you. Alright, let's, uh, we better take out these scorpions then. So let's see, let's put some fire magic on the treant, and let us use the, uh, blizzard on these scorpions. And the deal, let's go have you brave, and let us stomp on these guys. Stomp, stomp, stomp. Well, there's one tiz. Wow. These guys are a lot uh, tougher than I thought they would be. Uh oh. That can't be good. That can't be good. Idea! You gotta tank this! You gotta tank this! Nope. But check this shit out. Time slip! The special ability of the Time Mage. Even if you get knocked out, you'll get sent to the beginning of the battle. Once per battle, though. Once per battle. So, uh, let's, uh, let's not die this time. So, let's see. I'm gonna have you unleash your special on the Scorpion. Let's see. Let's, uh, Sword Magic. Equip Blizzard. And, actually, let's, let's not equip Blizzard. Let us, uh, let's focus on that Trim, because he was doing so much damage. And let's see, let's equip some, uh, some fire magic. And attack the Treant. Uh, Anyas, I'm gonna have you... Let's see, what would be good here? Let's drop some fires, let's just try and get rid of that, uh, tree branch thing. Do the same thing with ring -a So, fire, 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 fire. Make sure that thing dies. And we'll be able to default with the DF for the time being. Damn, Rainbow, you're just not you're not doing any damage with your fire attacks. Fly! See, that's the kind of damage I want to be seeing. I mean Eyes is doing so much damage! Alright, dear, it's all you then. So let's see. That scorpion has more damage on it. So let us uh, let's go for some shield strikes. Followed by a normal attack. Hmm. Okay. The uh 
Normal attack does a lot more damage. But there- oh my god, this thing is doing so much damage to us! So let's switch our sword magic over to Blizzard so we can get some super effective hits on this thing. And uh, Anya, so let's have you uh, drop some Blizzards on this thing. And uh, yeah, I'll just have you default for now. That was surprisingly difficult, I was not expecting that. Oh dear. Oh yeah, that's right, because, um... We're so low level right now, that's right. So, uh, let's put some high potions on people. This is gonna be interesting. I'm not even sure if I can keep bringing about a time mage then. We'll see, we will watch how this progresses. But, uh, Rainbow, is there any way for me to increase your, uh, your special, your magic attack? Because you're not doing a whole lot of damage. 45 versus 47. That's doing, like, why is he doing so low damage then? We shall investigate. We will do this by trial and error. Also, what's the deal with this water? Uh-oh. That can't be good. Ugh, what? My legs! My whole body's tingling! And not in a good way! The swamp! It's poison! The wind carried out the miasma, but the swamp's still just as toxic. It's nothing easy? Nope, not in this game. This is on hard mode, bro. I hate poison. Every step hurts, and I feel like I'm gonna be sick. We could always double back to town and stock up on antidotes. You worry too much. All we have to do is be careful to step around the marshy patches. Agreed. Let's be extremely careful where we walk. E. Oh dear, we're all poisoned. That's not good. Oh, it's a good thing I have like a million of these antidotes. Although, out of curiosity, we do have the Dungeon Master ability. So I wonder, does that prevent us from getting poisoned? I think we should investigate this. We should try this out. So let us switch over um, speed plus up for Dungeon Master. Let's see, do we get poisoned? <gasps> no, we don't! We don't get poisoned, that is... Oh, that's that beautiful. That is beautiful, I don't even need to worry about it. Oh, hello. Phallic-looking monster. Uh, yeah, if you could, uh, scan this thing, that'd be great. That was a crit? You call that a crit? Well, is anybody up in the mood for uh, some roasted mushroom? Cook it up with some uh, garlic, maybe? Let's see how much this does. 200, nice! Uh oh. He's calling reinforcements! Uh oh. This could get problematic. Anya, I need you to uh, fire all all cannons. All fire! All, 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 all must die. You too, ring a bell. Let's uh, bring whatever poor magic abilities you have into the, into play. One hundred. That's ring a bell. I'm disappointed. I expect more. See, Anya is doing so much more damage. Why is she doing so much more? It's gotta be the item. It has to be. Let's see, Anya, what did I put on you? It's not the item. It's the, she's just holding me through rods. I feel like I'm missing something. Me through rod, me through rod. Hmm. That's weird. Like seriously, why is uh, I'm actually very confused. As to why, uh... I'm getting so little damage on Ring of Bell. Any thoughts? Leave me a comment in the section below. Ooh, gonna be a first strike. That is fantastic. Okay, um... Let's deal with these Scorpions first, because they don't have... They are a lot easier to take down, so let's equip a Blizzard to Tiz. And we'll have him attack the Scorpion. Anyas, I'm going to have you... Use some black magic. Let's use some blizzards on the middle scorpion. Bring about have you default for the time being. Idea, I'm going to have you 
What can I do with you, actually? Prayer, mislead, chivalry, stomp. Let's focus on these scorpions. So let's see, 400. Oh, that's so much better. That's so much better. There's gotta be something else that I'm missing. Something obvious. Oh, we're doing solo damage. Alright, Ring of Bowman, have you unleashed your special on... What are Purple Blitzes do? We can enemy magic attack up for all allies. Okay. And let's see, let us drop some blizzards on the scorpion. Let's end this quick! Come on, big damage, big damage! No damage. Oh, it just drops her uh, attack strength. Magic hat down, magic defense down. Okay, that's actually not too bad. Not big on this getting hit by things, though. So, honestly, if you could set this tree on fire, that would be fantastic. Okay, I'm going to spend a minute to try and figure out why I'm doing so little magic damage, so... Behold, the power of digital editing! Okay, we're back from the lab. So, it turns out it's uh, basically just his uh, stats that are causing me grief. So, while Ring Bell and Honest do share roughly fairly close magical attack, the biggest difference between them is their mind. So, in addition to just ma straight up magic attack, we also have mind. Affects magic defense, healing power, uh, what actually meant is the intelligence. So it affects magic attack power and the chance to inflict status ailments. So Ayaz has a mind of 29, whereas Rainbow has a mind of 22. Sorry Rainbow, you're just not as uh, mindful as Ayaz is. Sorry, you're not as intelligent as Ayaz is, I keep getting the two mixed up. Which is a shame, because I actually kind of would like Rainbow as a time mage, but uh, he's just not doing the amount of damage that we need. So we, uh, we're gonna fix that. Rainbow, you need to change your class. As much as I want to get some of the abilities that are available in the Time Age, it's just not working out. So I'm going to make you a thief. And you're actually quite dashing as a thief, I must say. I'm just saying. And we are going to equip him with an arrow. Two and a weapon, but uh, he's going to have some pretty good uh, physical attack. And let's see, let's change our ability as well while we're at it. So there's not really anything that we need here. But, um, let us go with White Mage, maybe? White Mage would not be a bad idea, just because I can use Cure to keep our party topped up. So let's go with that. I'm primarily using it just so that I can use his MP to keep our party healed up instead of Onyx's MP. Because we're going to be needing hers in order to progress through the uh, dungeon here. I do see a chest, and I do want it, but how do I get to it? We fight enemies, that's how we get to it. Let's see, let's uh, let's go ahead and unleash our... S let's see, let's go ahead and equip a... Fire. And let's go special, hack and slash to the Treant. Attack the Treant, attack the Treant. Anya, so I'm going to have you use some blizzards on the Scorpion. Ring a bell, I'm going to have you... Shoot arrows at the tree, and Idea, I'm gonna have you attack the scorpion. Let's see how this goes. Oh, that's so much better! Okay, Rainbow, you're staying as a thief for the time being. Oh, that is, that's so much better. That is so much better. And we got a firewall support ability. Let's uh, let's check that out really quick. Let's see. We want sword magic. No wait, that's not the right one. I want job. There we go. Firewall has a 50% chance to counterattack with fire damage when hit with a single target physical attack. Ooh, that's good. That's really good. 
Let's see, let's uh, let's get let's get rid of speed and let's try this fireball. Let's see how this uh, works out for us. And that's the exit. I want to see these chests. I see five chests in this area. And you never know what kind of swag you can potentially get. The down being one of them. And I'm really glad that we have this Dungeon Master ability. This is basically just letting me walk on the swamp without any problems. Oh no! Things that, are, that have uh, fire weaknesses, what am I going to do? So let's see, let's, uh, let's focus on the mushroom first, because that's going to start multiplying. That's going to give us problems. So let's cast some magic, all foes. Ring a bell, I'm going to have you shoot this mushroom down with your arrows. If the uh, just attack. Uh-oh. Oh! I get it. Kind of. Physical attacks make it spore. To a limit? Yeah, to a limit. Okay, I will duly note that. Do not, uh, do not physically attack the mushrooms. Nice! Oh no, everyone's asleep. That's not good. Okay, in that case, uh, we're not in good shape here. That mushroom should be nearly dead, though. I kind of want to take it out, but at the same time, everyone's in pretty bad shape. So, let's see here. I'm going to brave. I'm going to drop some items on us. High potion on Tiz, high potion on myself. It's fine. Also fine. Okay. We definitely cannot hit that mushroom thing. So let's work on the tree branch. <laughs> One damage. I'll take it. It could be the difference between life and death, who knows. And the deal, let's unleash your special on uh, the treant. Actually, better yeah, let's have you heal people. We're getting very close to death here again. I don't have the time to save me again. Oh, there's my ring bell. I just wasted my high potion. Scum! Oh, poor Ring what am I gonna do with you? We have new items, that's what we're gonna do. So first, let's, uh, no, let's go back into our menu, please. I don't wanna be, uh, going off into the distance, riding off into the sunset without first, uh, doing some healing. Oh, we're so low on high potions, too. So, let's see. I'm gonna have, uh... Let's do some magic. Wow, that's, uh, that's not great, but whatever. He's not using his MP, so might as well. And, uh, there was a, an item that we received. It looked like a sword. Goes from 68 to 80. That is much better. How does it uh, look on Tiz, though? 76. Yeah, we're definitely going to put this on India. So what's it called? A Shimitar? A Shimitar? And another 2,000 peg! Very nice! Eep. Okay. Well, the Scorpions, you're going to be weak to ice, so let's equip some Blizzard. On this, I'm gonna have you use arrow on. Actually, I don't need to use arrow on the uh, butterfly. There's something else we can do about that. So instead, let's have uh, let's use blizzard on scorpions because they're gonna give us grief. Ring bell. I'm actually gonna have you hit the great moth because the nice thing about the arrows is that they have the ability they get extra damage on things that fly. It's so good. Look at that! 400! It's done. It's already done. Looking good. And you get to chill out. And you get to chill out. But look at there's another two chests here somewhere. So it's probably gonna be in the far bottom right? 
No, nothing here. So, Tiz, I'm gonna have you focus on the tree branch. So, sword magic, fire. Anyas, I'm gonna have you focus on the mushroom piercing bolt, followed by fire, fire, more fire. I'm gonna have you attack the tree. DM, I'm gonna have you attack the tree. Uh oh. It's gonna start sporing. Do not stand in my way. I need to pause for a moment, so I will be right back. And I'm back. Today is just not my day for recording. It just it really isn't. Oh boy, I took so much damage from that last boss, from that last battle. It hurt me in real life. Sorry, my uh, my nose started bleeding. So that was not particularly fun. It's not fun at all. But good lordy, just making like careless mistakes. I'm quickly bringing him up with uh, classes that he doesn't work well with. Oh dear. So let's go for a hack and slash on the scorpion and try and knock this thing out. Anyas, I'm gonna have you, uh, let's uh, put some blizzards on these scorpions. I'm so glad Anyas has so much MP. So let's see. Great Moth, you're done. Dia, I'm gonna have you uh, just attack things. Ooh, so good. I'm definitely liking Rainbow a lot better as a thief. All he doesn't, he doesn't have to wear that stupid timepiece on his head. I can you see his hair. His beautiful glowing hair. You know, he uh, takes good care of it, but you should be able to see it. You know, it'd be like, uh, you know, having a Dia and not being able to see her hair and her lovely bow. Tis, uh, Tis has bed head, so that's perfectly fine. At the very least, it feels like you know, I'm kind of roughly at the level that I should be at at this particular moment since I'm having trouble with uh, wild encounters at the beginning, but not so much that I'm getting my butt handed to me. If that makes sense. So let's see. Let's uh, put a blizzard on Tiz and work on the scorpion. Anyways, I'm gonna have uh, you unleash your special piercing bolt on scorpion. That will probably knock it out, and then we'll use some fires on the wood. Rainbow, I'm just going to have you attack whatever, and the yeah, you can attack whatever. Oh, so much damage! Rainbow, you beast! Three crits in a row! I feel like uh, Rainbow has finally found his groove. See, so we actually, oh okay, so that's how we get that other chest. We have to go around, go back in here, and then we can pick it up. And another explosion, very nice. That reminds me, I have I actually have not gone back into the clockwork and gotten all those items back. I kinda just went back in there, got the door unlocked, and then proceeded to fight the time mage. So I have to remember to go back there and grab that stuff. Oh well, I can do it later. It's not overly critical that we have it. So Tiz, I'm gonna have you uh let's see. Let's equip Blizzard, and just attack these Scorpions. Anyas, I'm gonna have you set that tree on fire. And Rainbow, you should attack whatever. I'm loving how this like firewall does like one damage, it's not even worth it. Like, that's supposed to be, like, super effective damage? That's that's pretty bad. Although... I would imagine that would be good on Anyas. I'm, I'm assuming the reason why it's doing so low damage is because Tiz's magic is so low. That, uh... That might not be a bad idea. Let's see, that's a level 3... That ha yeah, it's a level 3 ability. 
And do I have any uh, extra slots in Anya's support? Kind of, yeah. I don't always need silence immunity. I will keep that in mind. I will try it out uh, in my own time. But more importantly, we have uh, we have things to explore. We should explore this area as much as possible, especially since we have the Dungeon Master ability, which, which is going to pretty much make this entire whole poison bog thing completely useless. So let's see, Anya, let's have you do some arrowing. And ring a bell, let's have you clip everything's wings. Oh, ring a bell is a thief, it's so good! Oh, ring a bell, I'm probably gonna leave you as a thief for the time being. That is, it's, you're just doing so much damage, it's so good! I see the save man, but we have three more chests to find. Okay, Tiz, I'm gonna have you default. I guess I'm gonna have you set everything on fire. Then we also can just chill out. Okay. And Tiz, you should be able to finish it off. For a minute, I was very concerned that I was going to spore and create another, uh, another horde. Remedy, very nice, and there's two more chests to find. Now, there's the other one. So the other one must be in the center somewhere. Down here. No, we've explored everything. Is it closer to the exit? Oh, no, wait, there's one other spot in the middle that I did not see. So with the fault, ring a bell, if you could uh, take care of these mobs, that'd be great. And there's our last chest. So it looks like we are done with the Miasma Woods. We can go ahead, we can go up to the end, and we can save. Makes me wonder what's coming up ahead. There's someone I'd like you to meet. What do you say? What? Oh, we became friends with uh, BuddyBot. Thank you. So we will go ahead and save. Oh my goodness, I have 21 hours logged into this. I mean, some of it was from me just leaving my 3DS lying on the desk, some of it was me just playing in transit, usually on the uh, train or just on a uh, bus or whatever. And some of it was from uh, just lunch, just casual lunch breaks, so I would be grinding with my right hand and drinking coffee with my right. So in the next episode, uh, we will continue onwards. I've had enough of this uh, Miasma Woods, so until next time, thank you guys so very much for watching, and I hope you're having a fantastic day.